few warm up pitches, kind of started feeling tight, and um, at the end, just got too tight to throw. And you know, I thought it was best for the team to come out. Looks like you, you were okay devastated. You even so, come out of this game, right? Um, that's that's the game you want to be in, and you know to come out and you know. Obviously, I didn't want to hurt my team, and you know, being in the game with uh, you know too tight to throw falls uh, going to be effective. But you know, obviously, you want to do everything you can to be in there. Did you feel okay this morning? Yeah, uh, you know, the, the tightness I had earlier this week kind of went away, and you know, I felt great uh, leading up to this. I did everything this week to prepare. Um, like I said, the first two innings felt great, uh, but the, the third inning started to feel it. How confident are you that you can pitch again <clears throat> soon? Uh, I have to get with the training staff and talk about it. Um, you know, I haven't even thought that far yet. How hard was it just to deal with that on the mound? The fact that you knew you had to come out of the game. Extremely tough. Um, you know, I can't really put it into words. It's uh, you know the first reaction is you let your team down uh, and you feel like you did. Um, but you know it's a tough game to swallow. Um, you know, especially coming out early. So you don't think it's anything serious? I don't know. We'll have to look at it with the training staff. Why didn't you go into the training room while you were in the dugout? Why'd you just? You know, normally uh, when, you, when you feel good, you don't you don't do anything different than you've been doing all season. Just kind of hang out and you know heat it during the inning. And, uh, I felt good until that third inning. Oh, I meant after. Yeah. Thank you, Eric. Oh, I uh, came in and iced, but uh, you know, there's nothing we could really do at that point.